Women are driven by their emotions, yet sometimes they hide them to also protect themselves. And this can make it, well, very hard for you to tell if they actually like you, let alone love you. They might be acting one way and saying something completely different to you. You might actually find yourself feeling like, am I going crazy? And the truth is, you are not. Women are just very complicated when it comes to love, and I apologize. In today's video, we are gonna learn about the 20 things that women do when they genuinely love a guy. Like and subscribe. You have been dating for a while. Now, first and foremost, let's get this out of the way. Love at first sight really does not exist. If it's been a few months and you guys are still dating each other and there has been regular texts, lots of romantic dates and lots of flirting and intimate connection, this is the fun time to be in. It's full of anticipation and the whole what ifs because you're not quite sure how long it could last. And if you have been dating, I would say for more than six months, then there is a good chance that she loves you and is maybe waiting on the relationship to grow a little bit more for more progress to take place before she actually tells you. She wants to meet your family. If you mention Sunday dinner with your family and she does not immediately shut down the idea that she's ready for more, then this is a good thing. Meeting someone's family is a huge step and it kind of solidifies the relationship into actually being official. Now a lady will only ever meet your family when she is ready to commit to you. She confides in you. We only can find in people that we trust and those that we believe will actually be in our lives for the long term. We don't open ourselves up to strangers because, well, we don't trust them. And if she is opening herself up to you and telling you personal things, then make sure you listen up because it's a sign that she loves you. She wants to spend time with you instead of her friends. Have you ever asked a girl on a date and she said, oh, I actually have plans with my friends that night, but I can see if I can rearrange something. Women will only, remember this for life, they will only rearrange plans with friends when they truly believe that the man is worth it. If she does this and makes you aware that she's actually having to cancel plans with her friends to hang out with you, this is something you have to really take in consideration. It's a serious move. She stops being perfect. At the beginning of a relationship, women attempt to be perfect. Of course, you gents put your best foot forward and you try to be the best version of yourselves. But for women, it's more intense. Think about what we have to do. We have to preen, we have to shave, we have to make sure that we smell good, look good, have no pimples, don't look like we're aging. We strive for this perfection because we feel that's what guys want. But once they actually fall in love with you, they stop trying too hard. They kind of let their quirk show, maybe they don't shave their legs for a week because they feel comfortable with you because, well, she loves you. This one's kind of obvious, but it's worth getting it out the way. She is only dating you. If she makes it clear, and she will, that she is only dating you and no other men, it's obvious that she wants to take things a little step further. She wants to be your girlfriend and eventually she will tell you that she loves you. A girl will make it very obvious and tell you that she has deleted her dating apps. She talks about her future and you are in it. It could be a holiday that she's planning for a few months or a wedding she's going to next year. If she's talking about things that are going to happen in the future and includes you on the guest list, it's a sign that she wants you in her future because she loves you. Women will only ever include you in their future plans if they genuinely see you in it and want you to be there. She wants you to meet her family. Let's twist it around a little bit. Her mum and dad could be coming in town or she might be going home for the weekend and she could ask you casually if you want to come along. This is a sure sign that she is invested, she trusts you and she kind of wants to show you off because she loves you. She would not introduce you to her VIPs if she didn't think you were worth it. She talks to you about everything. Have a think, if it's no longer small talk, it's deep conversations, it's a great sign. She's gonna talk about, well, anything and everything which helps you both get to know each other better. And if she starts complaining about life stress, this is also a good thing. She's doing this because she wants you to know her on a deeper level and she wants to be able to open up to you. She's not phased about your faults. 
Now, we all have faults, right? Put our hands up. We all have something that people don't like about us. You might have opened up to her and said, you know what, this is the thing that I do that not many people like. Or she might have seen them through spending so much time with you. She stuck around though and she's not run off. This is because she genuinely loves you for who you are. Quirks as well. She remembers the things that are very important to you. Taking note of those important things that someone mentions and then repeating them back to them at a later date is a sign of, well, classic dating technique. It's also a thing that we do when someone is important to us. We remember what our parents say, we remember what our friends say, but if she remembers a thing that you find important, it's because she genuinely cares about you and she wants you to know that she is there and supporting you. Her friends consider you guys a couple. If you are at the stage of meeting her friends or maybe you bump into them randomly, then you can safely assume it's gonna be serious. If they already start referring to you guys as a couple, it's likely because she's, well, definitely spoken about you to them. They might casually say something like, oh, you'll be coming along together, right? Hinting that you guys are already together. Take it as them giving you their blessing as well. She compromises. She doesn't just demand everything that she wants. Let's say, for example, a really small example, you guys are getting takeaway for dinner and she decides that she wants Mexican, but you want to have Chinese food. And she's like, you know what, it's okay. Let's just get Chinese this time and then next time you can treat me to a Mexican. This is her being with you and compromising because she loves you and she's like, you know what, let's not argue over this. Let's have a nice loving relationship and do what you want to do. You are her priority. You will notice that a girl that is in love with you will put you above anyone and anything else. Obviously, our friends and our family are important to us, but once we find someone who is really special, then they become our number one because we're going to live with them eventually, so they do get kind of first dibs on plans. She wants to spend the rest of her life with you because she loves you, which means she puts you first. And if something comes up where you need some help with something, she will drop everything and anything to be there for you. This is my favorite one of the whole video. You become part of her family traditions. I mentioned before that she will want you to meet her family, but does she have any unique family traditions? Maybe the family is Halloween mad and it's that time of year that brings you all together and it's very special to her family. Every family has some form of tradition, but if she makes you part of that family tradition and really makes it obvious that you have to be there, it's because she views you as a member of her family. It's important to her that you are included because she most definitely loves you. You probably won't notice this one. It's a very small thing. It's literally the word we. It's something that you didn't realize you actually want to hear in a conversation. And when you hear her say, we will do this and we will make these plans, you were like, oh, I'm getting butterflies. It's something so simple. By naturally changing the way that you guys talk and describe it as a we situation rather than me or you, it means she has formed that bond in her brain. She makes plans. You don't have to do all the work. She makes the plans as well. She organizes the dates, the outings with group of friends, and she also includes you in plans that she already has made. This is her starting to build a life for you both because she loves you. She gives you gifts. Now I'm not talking about birthday gifts, even though they are very important. She's not buying you gifts for the sake of it. She's doing it to show that she cares. For example, she could buy you something that you said you wanted just out of the blue. This is a sign of love. And it could be because this is her love language. And you can take a test to find out what your love language is. And if you want to know more about that, we do have the link to the five love languages book by Gary Chapman down in the description box below. But essentially, when she starts giving you things, it's because she wants to make you happy. And let's face it, she's not going to buy a gift for a random person in the office. She tells you she misses you. Maybe it's been a few days since you have seen each other and she messages you and she lets you know how much she's thinking about you. And she genuinely will mean it because she's head over heels for you. When we love someone, we want to be with them all of the time. When we try to be with them, well, every single moment, we get addicted to them. We want more and we want more and more. Have you ever felt this? If so, it's because she's telling you she misses you because she loves you and she can't get enough. She will say the magical words, I love you. Finally, we've reached number 20, the most obvious one of the video. She says those magical words, I love you. 
Now, a lady is only going to say this when she really means it, guys. Specifically, if you guys are a lot older than a teen relationship, she will reserve those words for that moment where she has that deep clarity that she does, in fact, love you. And if she says it to you, it's because she really does mean it. If you think I missed something from today's video, let me know down in the comments. Give me a huge thumbs up and consider subscribing to make my day. But if you wanna get your name rolling up next to my face, like these amazing people's names here, then all you have to do is click the link in the description bar below to find out a little bit more. Have an amazing day, see you soon.